Hi guys, it's Ruthie with the Popo Backyard Farm. You know, people always act like it's a great big wonderful deal when they see, say, a duck hatching a chicken or a chicken hatching a duck or, you know, a cow nursing something different. But this is very common in farming, actually, and a nice thing to learn about. Um, I even heard of a, of a pig um, nursing tigers. <laughs> but if you are into homesteading and farming, that's something you need to learn and be aware of. Because sometimes what happens is you are in a crisis and you have to do something. I remember one time I had a rabbit and uh, she had a big huge litter and it was her first litter and she does not she was not going to take care of any of them so I was going to lose like 10 rabbits which wasn't how do I put it it was more of the thing of the you know care of animals that I was concerned with I didn't want to lose the life so I scooped up the babies and I had like six other rabbits that had babies you know, because they all kind of came and had their babies at the same time. So I gave each of the mothers an extra baby or two babies, depending on, you know, the mother. And like if she had maybe five babies, I might give her two. If she had eight babies, I might give that one one. And this is just something that goes on when you're raising animals is to learn, you know, if you run into a situation so that you can save the life of your animal, it's a pretty cool thing. And it's really rewarding when you see, like in my situation with the bunny, um, the other rabbits kept the babies for a couple of weeks. And then, you know, I was worried because you never know how things are going to go. But usually, believe it or not, it's a, more of a positive than a negative. Um, I picked up the babies and gave them back to the original mother and she was fine and she worked it out. It was just, she was probably scared, new to mothering and uh, she didn't reject the babies. And if she did, I would have just put them back with the other mothers. But um, I just thought that something that happens all the time, all the time in farming, it's not unusual at all. Like I said, a tiger um, even got nursed by a pig. <laughs> so anyway, I hope you enjoyed this. I hope this gets your mind thinking. And remember, big or small, you too can be a backyard farm. God bless.